There we go. Now it seems to be up. Alright. So I'm back with more Resident Evil. I'm sure I'm just gonna fail my way through a bunch of crap. And so I figured I'd broadcast it so maybe at least people can laugh at it or something. Wait. What the hell did I do? There we go. Uh, playing as Chris. Why am I doing this again? I guess I like to torture myself. That's gotta be it. As a matter of fact, I think that's the only possible answer. Shit, there goes my phone. Probably broken. Now I can tell I'm standing in a room. There we go. Wait, it was before I fought Plan 42? Ah, shit. Flight Plant 42, then. I really didn't save it after I brought all this shit back to my other trunk. Because as I'll remind anybody that ever watches me play on Real Survival, the trunks don't connect in this mode. And it's pretty obnoxious. I could have sworn to got us further than this, but maybe not. I want to know how the hell I actually get Rebecca. To be like... I guess she only does it after the, the boss fight? Heals my wounds and such. Uh, that's absolutely not what I wanted you to do, Chris. I didn't touch the right thumbstick at all. Not really sure why that one happened, but... thought so. Yeah, it's probably been a long time since I actually checked that door. Like he's got auto aim, or she. I don't really know. Ow. Damn. <laughs> the goddamn butthole. is dripping. I can't even move again before it starts dropping acid on me. 
this is like a joke, right? I had actually already played this part. Dick. F you. Cool, it's already waiting for me. Sprite. <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna effing die against Plant 42. Come on, open up, bitch. Oh my god, and it's already dripping acid at me. Or whatever the f it is. Damn it! Look at how far that fucking thing goes. Oh my god, and it still hit me. And it killed me. Plant 42. I've honestly got to say, I think that's the first time the Plant 42 has ever killed me. In all of the time that I've played Resident Evil. Like I said, I thought I had already fought that son of a bitch, but I guess I didn't. Because this is my li- Oh, never mind. I did. I'm an idiot. Good. I don't have to fight him again. F that. Pretty sure I kicked his ass the first time. Or what passes for an ass kicking in real survival mode. I got all my weaponry and health where I need it. And 19 shotgun shells. Yikes. Who is calling me? No. Go away. Alright, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, I got everything I need. So, as Chris, what would be the best helmet key door to go open first? Oh, that's right, he's gonna jump down. Come on, jump! No, not, like... Ah, oh, you're a dick. You were supposed to go the other way. Oh, no auto-aim. <laughs> He's gonna kill me, too. Ready, here it is. Yup. And I can't even aim in time. Because he's so slow. He faked me out anyway. He's supposed to jump down off the damn balcony. I guess I might as well def... Uh, see, I was gonna not use the shells, but I might as well use the damn shells, because otherwise I'm gonna die. I already took out the other one. Wait, do I have any? No. I'm probably gonna need that herb soon, regardless. swipe. That was pretty sweet. Eat shit. Like I said, I figured I'd have to use it soon anyways. I could probably take another strike before getting in danger, but... Once you're below... I think... I think fine, truthfully. Not even yellow caution. The hunters can kill you in one shot if they do that dashing swipe. Where are you? There you are. Alright, more over towards this wall. Come on. 
more over towards this wall. Add a guy. Give me enough space to get by there. Be a sport. Oh. Eh, whatever. I probably should have opened that fucking helmet key door that's raw on this side. Actually, that's probably where I should be going now that I think about it. Oh, well. Whatever. Yes, actually, I need those. Normally, ink ribbons are like the bane of my existence, but not in this mode. Ah, I should have brought my handgun with me, too. I shouldn't be using shotgun shells on zombies. Of course, it did blow his head clean off from a good camera angle, so I really can't complain about that. I'll trade a shell for that. Oh yeah, a puzzle. I forgot about this puzzle. Yeah, I need the uh, red jewel for it anyway. to control this game like it's zero. I just couldn't play that tonight. I couldn't do any more Resident Evil Zero. Maybe, uh, maybe by the weekend. Yo, what's going on, Fico Vision? <sighs> Playing this game is kicking my ass again. <laughs> Alright, so I got the helmet key. I can go take out all those zombies with my handgun now. Well, maybe I should have brought the shotgun in. Anyway. This way. Come. There you go. Now you got it. You can open the door. Uh, come on. I 
hate the way the controls do that. As soon as the camera angle flips. I don't know if anybody ever noticed, but uh, both of those paintings are of terrible things. I need to use the X button and the D pad. Oh, duh. I gotta hit the switch anyway. I'll take it. Close enough. Hmm. Yeah, actually, I should have just enough space. Nice. That's good, man. Yeah, that's something I gotta do again. I haven't bought myself a new PC in a while. I should customize one for gaming, so, like, not only could I play these Resident Evil remakes, but I'd actually be able to play, like, the original game and all kinds of crap that I remember from when I was younger. <laughs> Really? Barely even grazed me. And it was like it was precognitive. Uh, precognitive about it. Ah! I left you guys. I'm out here. I don't have to come back, so I'm not even bothering. Shot. Is this dude dead? No. Oh, yeah, definitely. Damn. Dude has eaten enough lead to fucking shit studs. There we go. two daggers. It might be the first time I've had two defensive items at once since I started playing on Real Survival as Chris. Yeah, let me stand in about a foot of water and throw a power switch. It's exactly what I want to do. Yeah, well, you know Pablo. I mean, that's kind of what he does for a living. Hey, there's, there's Brian. 
Got time to watch video games, and you got time to play them until goddamn 1.30 in the morning. You bastard. <laughs> you bastard. Uh, I guess I should go drop this shit off in the trunk. Although that means I'm gonna have to run. Uh, it doesn't matter. Even if I have to go past hunters, I'm not. I don't have the inventory space to pick up everything downstairs I need. So I have to go drop some shit off. There's one. I'm just gonna run past you if you don't mind. Part of the price you pay. Advertising. Alright, so the only thing in here is a knife. So I gotta remember that I'm leaving some shotgun shells. Actually, maybe I should... No, I don't have the space to take the shells with me. Because I don't think there's any more downstairs. <laughs> Just tweet the word Dark Souls and that Dark Souls bottle retweet it. Should have left a key too, but F it. Damn it! I was pet. What was that? Why am I standing still for so long? I don't remember that being the case. I'm dead. No, oh, wait. He took his time. Thank God. I don't remember their claws affecting me that much that I couldn't run past them. I keep forgetting there's no auto aim. You know what? Forget it. Not even wasting the ammo on your ass. I'm so used to auto-aim that I just automatically... Huh. I don't like the fact that you just aim at whatever you're facing. That's kind of annoying in this game. He's not even dead. <laughs> Thumbstick. Are you serious? Take that. How convenient, right when I need them. Have I ever mentioned how much I hate playing as Chris? No Jill Valentine.
What else can I do with the helmet key? <laughs> oh yeah, there's that door through here. Oh, and of course there's that door through there too. Probably still easier access from here though. It's not even worth it now, because there's hunters out here, aren't there? Is there any... But there are some to use, so that's good to know. It's like a little safety net there. <laughs> if I can make it back up here. Which is a big if. Have to go upstairs anyway. Screw that. Alright, so there's gonna be a crimson head waiting for me right on the other side of this door, so I need to just start moving and hope he doesn't catch me the second this comes up. Ah, oh, you still got me, the bastard. I was so close. gonna be well he'll be waiting to that same dickhead will be waiting for me to the right same place he was before so not right out here Sometimes you can give them the slip. Other times, not so much. more rounds that it would probably take an entire clip of 15 rounds to take down a hunter if I were to actually take the time to shoot it. Oh, 
Come on, buddy. Keep paying attention. A little bit further. There you go. No, I'd like to leave it there. Keep following me. No? As far as you're gonna go? Alright, fair enough. As usual, no, I want to leave that in there. Although I guess it's giving you a chance to reject the item, it's a good thing in case you're, I don't know, going to be filling up your inventory with bullshit when you don't need it. Oh, damn it, I gotta go back past that hunter. I should go get my damn shotgun. Put this fucking handgun away. Uh, which, because this is on real survival, requires me to go all the way back to the trunk that's in the east wing. On the first floor. I think there's hunters. Run, 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 Chris, run. Good hustle, buddy. Good hustle. I got 40 rounds. I think that would probably be enough to take down the zombies that are in here. I shouldn't have to come back through here that much. I hope. I don't know. Maybe I'll leave this one alive because he's never paying attention. This one's got to go. No. Oh, forget it. <laughs> huh. I guess I could always cap him here. Take it. Fucking stay dead already. Lord. Zombies. I actually just watched Forrest Gump for probably like the first time in like, I don't know, six or seven years. Last weekend? Maybe the weekend before. I don't know. Wasn't necessarily my idea, but my girlfriend was watching it, so I sat there and watched the whole thing. This is an awfully complicated puzzle for a freaking key. So I can't say I wouldn't love to design a mansion like this. Well, minus all the monsters and shit. <laughs> I 
Kind of feels like it might be a good time to save, too. Oh, wait. I might as well collect what I'm going to get with the brooch key before I do anything else. Pablo joins my broadcast for like three minutes and then decides he wants to play Doom. <laughs> what a butthole. Rebecca. Oh yeah. I forgot about that. I like how the box even says eight cartridges, but it only gives me six. Let's roll out. Let's go see if we can save Rebecca. Otherwise, she's going to get cut up like a Thanksgiving Day turkey. Something like that. I don't know. Well, a lot more blood than a Thanksgiving Day turkey. through that this door because like the doorknob's broken or something right no knob on that door All right right no knob because that makes a door impossible to go through Kidding me? Ugh. Eat shit, Rebecca. Eat Please. shit. Okay? I didn't mean to get you worried. We can't stay here anymore. I didn't mean to almost get, get killed. To get to way, way to go, go stupid. With me? Yes. Then I'll go ahead. Until then, Rebecca, you're on your own. Stay cool and use your better judgment. Got it? I can handle myself. Ridiculous what she survives before this in Zero and then runs away from in this game. battery but I'm sure I have a bunch of crap to bring with me anyway so it's gonna stay here for now I need that saves already. <sighs> Why would I want it? No. Of course, I'm also still pressing the wrong buttons like I'm playing zero as well, so... Keep trying to hold the B button to run, and it's the X button in this damn game. Right, so, there's no one here. What else? Oh, I'm going across. 
across the other side of the mansion. That's what I gotta do. to note again that the fact to that I chose real survival and played as Chris ah dead I'm dead oh wait I have stuff hold on there we go eat that shit how'd that feel ow he still hit me Am I not close enough to the door? Christ. I don't give me any room for slop in this game, really. And then when I go down this hallway, this way, they come flying in through the window. Already swinging claws and shit. this. for rescuing Jill, but if I'm playing through as Chris, there's no way I'm not rescue not not rescuing Jill, I should say. If I shoot one it'll bring them both down on me, but I'm not sure where they have either of them are. Oh, I never heard it make that noise before. That's crazy. I'm not sure what the hell the one upstairs was doing. Alright, so... I'm gonna need those. I will need that. I will need that. I will need that. And I will eventually need that. The knife can stay. That's everything in this trunk. Right. Well, the other one didn't see me, but let's see where this one is. Well, he still doesn't see me. Uh, maybe I should try and get him to like jump across at me over here. Come on. No, he's coming up the stairs now. Damn. I'm not really sure how that... Wow. He missed me, thank God. You know what? F you. I just shot you! Hunters are not Joe Conroe survival.
Hell yeah. I still have to fight the snake on this side, but I'll worry about that afterwards. weird. I'm just not feeling very talkative tonight. Normally I'm, I can't shut my mouth while I'm playing video games. here so I can come back and get it later. And right, go fight the snake. Of course, during that whole time I had my mic on mute when I actually was talking. <laughs> uh, it's, it's a bad night for me. Feels like it's been a long day, too. Yeah, I already collected everything from there. Oh, yeah, right, going to fight Snake. See, I can't even remember I'm going to fight the damn Snake. Snake. <laughs> yeah, I hadn't really said much for a while, and then while I was talking, 
I look down and I see the orange mute button on my controller on. I'm like, son of a bitch. Like I said, it's been a long day. That was loud as shit. Let's see how much handgun ammo I can pop in this mother. Oh, that's right. There's no auto aim. I don't even think I hit him. I thought I got away from that one. Duck. Oh, oh, that's good. Come on. Ah, it was my own fault. Try. Uh oh. I'm in danger. I'm amazed it hasn't eaten me whole yet. Why won't you die? There we go. Yeah, I have a, uh, I have like a toggle switch on the uh, wire of the headset, which sometimes I forget is switched off, <laughs> and that's even worse because that one I can't see. Like, there's a, um, I have the controller that I can plug my headphones directly into. But I actually like to use the adapter um, because it has a mute button on it. It makes it easier, and that way, most of the, most of the time, unlike that last time, I don't forget that I have it on. I can just press it, and then like it, I, I I'll actually see most of the time that I'm muted instead of like the toggle switch on the on the wire of the mic headset that actually <laughs> I, I forget sometimes that it's switched off. And I'll forget for, like, hours at a time. Because I don't use it that much. I also have an aftermarket headset, truthfully, too. Oh, okay. That's actually kind of good. I am so dead. See, I don't understand why he's getting all grabby already. Ah, shit, you weren't supposed to turn there. Asshole! Your head's supposed to come off in one shot, too. Waste shotgun shells. how much health I actually wasted. Thin this playthrough as Chris, I guess I should say. I don't 
I never play as Chris. I'm not used to the six inventory spaces. I'm not used to not having a partner that kicks ass like Barry Burton, the way Jill Valentine does. <laughs> Rebecca kind of sucks. I mean, face it, all she is in Zero is basically a pack mule. And then in this game, she just heals your wounds a couple times. So, I'm just going to keep going until I get more health or I die. Because I'm on danger and I'm not saving it while I'm on danger with no health left. Even if I have all the items. Because that's just going to lead to me dying over and over and over again. So we're just going to take a chance and see how far I get. If I find health, I'll save it again. If I don't, well, then screw it. I die. Hell, it might be one of those tiny little snakes that kills me. If they're still out there. Which they should be, I would imagine. Dropping out of the trees and crawling on the ground, biting me and poisoning me, little scumbags. Those damn dogs are still alive out here, too, aren't they? <clears throat> I've left... I've left a lot alive in this game, and yet... They're... I still don't have a whole lot of ammo. That's how little they give you. There they are. Little, f little fucking butt lickers. <clears throat> Bunch of goddamn little buttholes. Surprised that didn't kill me, truthfully. me. Just barely, but you missed me. Now his buddies will get me up here. Don't worry, I have to go past him twice. Oh, he tried to grab me. Might have just given me the space I need. Of course, I still gotta get back through here again. I suppose I could use the shotgun, but I already have, like, no fucking ammo left. 16 shells? That's like nothing for me. I'm normally what they call an ammo hoarder. I guess I should. Well, maybe not. No, actually, I don't need to bring anything from the trunk that's in there. Do I? No. So all I gotta do 
is magically get past these dogs without getting bit. Uh, from beating the game, still a couple, um, like, areas away. I just, this is the second time I'm leaving the mansion. I have to go into the tunnels, like the underground, uh, sewer area. Ah, damn it, this thing's already on my ass. I'm trying to fake it out. Well, it kind of worked. Of course, it didn't bite me there when the camera flipped back on me, but, um... After you go down into these sewers, then you have to go back into the mansion, and then you hit the basement lab. So, probably, well, considering how long this has taken me, probably like an hour and a half away from beating the game, but in reality, I don't know, maybe like, there should probably only be about 40 minutes worth of game left, maybe. But, I wasn't expecting to get more ink ribbons, so actually... I think I'm just gonna save it. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save it, and I'll uh, come back and take my chances next time. Because uh, I appreciate you watching and everything, Flaco, but nobody really seems interested in Resident Evil tonight, so maybe I'll come back home with something else. It's 10 o'clock. Feels like it's time to get something to eat anyway. So I'm gonna save this game, and uh, this seems like a good place to end this broadcast. Thanks for watching, man. I'll uh, see you next time I'm on.